We live in an unequal world where there are distinct variations in levels of development. There are lots of different ways we can measure the various aspects of development. Development is all about making things better through change and helping to improve the standard of living and the quality of life for people. There are different factors that can affect the level of development. Environmental factors such as climate or natural hazards. Social factors such as access to safe water or hospitals. Economic factors such as trade and even political factors such as the stability of the government will all affect the development of a country. The development gap indicates the difference between rich countries and poor countries. So what can we use to measure different aspects of development? The Gross National Income, or GNI, looks at the total value of goods and services produced by a country, along with paid to or coming from other countries. It is a common measure used across the world and is usually expressed as per capita of the population. The World Bank divides the world into four levels of income, high, higher middle, low middle and low income countries. Living in a high income or low income country doesn't always indicate a good or bad quality of life or standard of living. Newly emerging economies are countries who are experiencing rapid rates of economic development. Two such examples are known as the BRICS countries and the MINT countries. Can you work out which countries these might be? The Human Development Index, or HDI, is a measure from the UN. It's a social measure that uses three different indicators to see how people have benefited from economic development. The three measures are life expectancy at birth, number of years in education, and GNI per capita. Using these three indicators together, the HDI is then calculated to create a value between 0 and 1, with 1 being the highest. By doing this, countries can then be ranked to show their level of development. There is a difference, though, between standard of living and quality of life. Standard of living can be measured through social and economic indicators, whereas quality of life can be very different in different countries. A good quality of life might mean that women have equal rights, that people feel secure, that there are free and fair elections. How happy people are within their country is about their quality of life. Development is a never-ending process that has benefited some countries more than others. We need to see how and why this is the case and understand how every country can improve its standard of living and quality of life.